What's up everybody? It's Titanic Feet Jack and I'm back at you again with another video. Today we're going to take it back to 84. A few good things happened in the great year of 1984. We're going to look at some sneakers that started out in 1984. But before we get into that, I need a couple things from you guys. I need you to hit that like button on today's video. Also, do hit that notification bell so you'll be notified every time I come back with another video. Do leave a comment down below. Drop them comments down in the comment section, guys and gals. And sub up to the channel if you haven't already. Now, today, like I said earlier, we're going to take it back to 84. A few good things happened in 84. This sneaker we we're about to look at came out. We had the 1980s full World Fair that was held in the place I will be celebrating tonight. We're going to get into that a little later. And LeBron James, I believe he was actually born in 1984. But uh, there's this event coming up tonight, a reunion, 30 years. Y'all know where I'm from. Cash Money Records, 30 year anniversary will be taking place tonight at the Caesar Superdome. At the Essence Fest, you know, Jeezy, Wayne, Turk, you know, they're doing their thing. They're coming together at the Essence Fest, and y'all know how we rocked it back when Cash Money and No Limit was making their, uh, their entry into the national spotlight. We wore Big T's, Jabos, and Soldier Rees. So... Knowing that I was going to check this out tonight, I went to the outlet, my Reebok outfit, and shoot, your boy came up on something. And this is a his and hers. I got a plan for me and the wife. Yep, we will be attending the uh, Essence Fest tonight, checking out them boys. CMB, baby. I'm going to read the box label to you guys. It says Workout Plus Men. And this is a, a size 7. The color is black and charcoal. And my pair is a size 15. They run a little small, so I had to go up. But surprisingly, they have about four or five pairs in size 15. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm talking about the Soldier Reebok. Take a good look at them. That's what we wore back in the 90s. Like I mentioned, these did initially come out in 1984. They did an update to them, which uh, came out in 1987. And it's basically, it's a way of life down here with these. Soldieries, Big T's, and Jabot shorts. I still got a few pairs of Jabot shorts. I probably wear a pair of them tonight. You're going to catch me in that thing. You know, take the wifey out. We're going to drink up all the brown and all the white tonight as we celebrate with the Cash Money Records with their anniversary. And this not the uh, best part about it. We got these for, I think, let me see. I got the receipt. Yep, uh, they were regular price $59.97, but they had a sale store-wide 60% off, and then I got an additional 20% off for military discount. So before taxes, these came to 38 bucks. <laughs> yes, Lord. So basically 19 bucks a pair for a little nostalgia. And I will be stomping in that Caesar Superdome, excuse me, with these, the soldieries, baby. I'm going to get my tea. Y'all going to just pay attention to my Instagram stories. I'll probably post the fit, see how I'm rocking. But uh, let me know y'all thoughts on this sneaker. If y'all are rocking with us down here in the booth. And that's going to be it. Now, like I always tell you guys, if you can help somebody get a sneaker, help them get that sneaker. Because you never know. Well, it will be your turn to need help getting the sneaker. I'm Titanic Feet Jack, signing out.